My work ethic came directly from my father because when I got to be probably in about the eighth grade, he decided it was time I got a job. So I didn't know what to do. I was not very skilled in the eighth grade of going out and get a job. So my first job, I started out at 50 cents an hour. And I was working for Bobby Jack Minter at the gas station, pumping gas, changing oil, learning all the little things about, uh, about the car. And then we worked all the way up to where he actually in, enjoyed me working there. And I got all the way up to where I was making a buck 25 an hour. And I'm gonna tell you that from there, I went and started working at a, uh, at a uh, auto parts store. My dad through high school, and then from there, he pulled me back to work with the horses. So at no time did I not have a job. That was not even acceptable in my household. You're not going to just go to school and come home, play with your friends and get in bed. No, not the way it works at the McCall house. You're going to have a job, you're going to work, and then you're going to go to college. And that's where it was. And I guess if you ingrain that in somebody at a young enough age, you know, at my age right now, I'm still juggling multiple jobs. And honestly, I don't know how to get off of it. I just keep on working. And I don't even think about not working.